Hi everybody and welcome back to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2 here with Arthur Morgan uh, harnessing the power of mustaches and hats. Mustache and hats. It's also just starting to get dark, I just realised. Yeah. Well, that's somewhat unfortunate, but while the night the daylight may be dying and the moonlight may be burning, we are so Arthur. Arthur. gonna talk to ducks. That's exactly what we're gonna do. That's right, I had to think of there for a second. Well now, you sweating yet, Dutch? Of course I'm sweating. Magicians for sport. Swampy, pixie whistling shithole. <laughs> uh, I meant about what Trelawney said about these bounty hunters. Well, not sweating as such, but maybe a little gentle perspiration. Until we know more, ain't too much harm in wasting good liquor on sweating. So? So, I think you should pay Mr. Trelawney a visit and find out exactly what he knows and who he spoke to. Take Charles with you. Oh, the sight of the pair of you would make a statue sing out its secrets. Okay. All right, Charles. Glad to hear. Who the fuck is he? Oh, here he is. Charles, I need you for some business in town. Come on. Okay. I give two shits. Hey, Lenny, what are you doing by Roach? Leave Roach alone. Hey there, girl. There we go. Ride to Trelawney's location. Do it. Dixie whistling shit. Oh, that's funny. Oh, Dutch. Oh, fuck. Where are we funny. Going? My sense of direction. Dutch wants us to have a talk with Trelawney. About these bounty hunters who are coming for us. Hoping he can tell us who they are or where they're coming from. Okay. And you're deputies now. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> Soon as we laid eyes on that fool of a sheriff who runs that town, I knew Dutch was gonna play him like a fiddle. On the run from one bunch of lawmen, working for another. Interesting. Hiding in plain sight, Dutch calls it. Hmm. <laughs> so, spirits seem good. Oh, fuck. In the new camp, I mean. We got some space between us and that mess now. I ain't seen no more Pinkertons for a while. There's these bounty hunters, of course, but Dutch don't seem too worried about it. Can't believe they're still coming after us. We didn't even get away with the money. Yeah, but they don't know that. Of course. Trelawney. I've only met him a couple times, but he's he's a strange one. These women's got it. But we're the Fear deputies. Not. He's just a cockroach in fancy britches. But he gets into nooks and crannies the rest of us can't. We just need to find him before he scurries off again. Ugh. Thanks, Charles. Whoa. Reckon it's that one with the fire outside. Let's take a look. What, is he hold up in like abandoned houses? Someone got here first. So it seems. By the looks of things, it wasn't a social call. Check the house. Bed's not made, so he must have been here recently. Good, good deduction there. Um, anything? Yeah, there's something there. This food's barely touched. Looks like he left in a hurry. What do you think? Anything there? Uh, take this killed more mining company certificate. Mine share.
cigar. There's something over here. There's also an apple for me to take. Big struggle. Pretty recently, I'd Look, say. I guess tracks. maybe, uh... Come on. Nobody? Not yet. There's some blood here. That ain't good. Come on. Before they get too far ahead. All right, you're waiting for us. Yep. Hmm. They went down the path. How's your tracking these days? All right. I guess. Oh, they're good. Well, lead the way then. Not the kind of place I'd expect to see Trelawney staying in. No? Normally scams himself into the best hotel in town. You know, when me and Javier went down with Trelawney to get Sean, after the bar fight, I swear, he talked the whole way and never actually said a damn thing. I thought you knew. That's his special talent. They could be 20 Shit. miles away by now. We can track them that far if we need to. Depends on how much you want to find them. Yeah. Right here? I still ain't sure about that. What's wrong, Arthur? Excuse me. Yeah. Have you seen him? <clears throat> we're, uh, we're looking for our friend. I don't think he's here. Ah, <laughs> uh, you seen a strange sort of feller. Sort of formal, strange, sure, formal, no. He uses a cane. Looks a lot like this one. Yeah. All right, you two. Where the hell is he? You both better get out of here. Come in. Ah, fuck my hat. Oh, I got it. Give me my hat. Give me my hat. It's my power. Thank you. Where is Trelawney? I don't know anything. Oh, dear. Tell me Maybe now. He is. You go to hell. You better tell me now, you son of a bitch. Okay. Okay, for Christ's sake. They took him to a cabin over by the cornfields. Which cornfields? Left. Down the path there by Braithwaite Manor. Um. <laughs> well, that's that. How's that bad? All right. Let's okay, do it. 26 to hold on. And then how much do you have, sir? $30. Oh, shit. That was worth it. Come on, let's go. How was that bad comment? He kidnapped our friend. No witnesses. Follow me. I think there's a way around so we don't have to go through the Braithwaite's place. Yes. I've spent enough time there. After you, then. Yeah, let's not go through the brave fight. It's creepy, man. Look at that okay. shit. I'm good. What do you think they want with Trelawney? Could be any one of a hundred things. Just depends if any of them involve us. You think he'll talk? Of course he'll talk. He'd sell his own sister to save a train fare. He don't know how not to talk. He don't know where we're holed up, though. At least I don't think he does. I don't know why Dutch still deals with him. Always disappearing for weeks on end. He's got his uses, and well, loyalty matters to Dutch. Of course. But is Trelawney loyal? Yeah, kind of. I guess Trelawney ain't exactly disloyal. Just got a big mouth. Don't worry. If he talked, I'll goddamn find out what he said. Uh, 
Nothing's ever straightforward where Trelawney's involved. Learn that much. I mean, hey, how much time have we wasted getting this fool out of trouble? He somehow manages to be both lucky and unlucky at the same time. <laughs> That's one way of looking at it. But he always finds some way to pay us back. Just when we think about cutting him loose, he brings us something big. I guess that's his special talent, keeping fish on the line. I thought I was talking, but okay. I do want to kill one of those boars one day. Make good eating. This is part of Braithwaite's manor? Must be. That must be it. I should do. Real quick like. Just eat the apple. After that oh. sack, this will be remembered like a good time. Put the man down, gentlemen. Uh, 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 Is that the lot of them? I, I think so. Uh, so you're uh, alive. Allegedly. Well, don't worry, they won't be for much longer. Look, go get them, Arthur. I can handle this. God damn it. Back this way. How is he not down? You wait till I find you. We need to find these guys. That's right, uh, that's Charles. Kick right over there. Goddamn hat, son of a bitch. They man plug me too. Did you see those birds? You ruined my day. Is that Charles? Excuse me, I thought one of them went over here. Let's split up. Definitely split up. Charles is just gonna shit on me this thing. Look around. He can't have gone far. Oh, 
Fox. Ow. That did hit me. Ow, no, no. I got you now. Took your head out, sunshine. Take from the rich and these. Let's go see how badly they beat up the slippery fella. I wonder how much trouble he's brought with him. Uh, <laughs> guess we'll soon find out. Oh, what gun do they Seems got like drop? We can't catch a break now, Arthur. Our luck's held this long. We got out of worse scrapes than this one. Mm, so I heard. <laughs> Rear rolling so, black rifle. Was to us. Uh, I hope you're right. Uh, I guess because it's gold. Holy shit. So golden guns are definitely worth keeping. It's so big I can't even put it on my back. Oh yeah, I can. Oh, I was gonna get your loin. I did lose that man, didn't I? I didn't lose this man. The fuck not. <laughs> money, money, money. Must be funny. In a cowboy's world. Holy shit, those guys were. Mr. Trelawney! Oh, Where are you? Let me guess, he's run away. Well, he's still here at least. Put your feet up, why don't you? You okay? Never finer. So, who was they? Uh, they were bounty hunters. Uh, attached to Cole Stoudemire. Okay. They weren't looking for me, per no. se. What'd you tell them? Not much. I told them I was an intellectual. Come down here from Oregon. Looking for a job at the university. Of course, they didn't believe me. Seems you stirred up quite a hornet's nest in Blackwater. So I keep here. It might be best if I stay with you gentlemen for a while. Can't go back to that caravan now. All right, Charles. You take Trelawney back to camp. I'll catch up with you. Okay. Damn, dude. There always seems to be more, more and more civilization. I want to get back in the open country of the West, or what's left of it, but even that ain't the way I remember it. Magicians for sport. We got silver again, so good. What is it to do in roads? Oh, that's what there's to do. You stay here, Roach. 
I'm gonna run it out. So you should follow me though. Running. Level seven, baby. That's what I wanted. Arthur is so fast. He's so fast. That's who wants to talk to you. You okay there, mister? You need me to move. Move? I am. I'm sitting in the wrong place. Excuse me? No, I didn't mean any offense, sir. Please. I don't get your meaning. I'm very sorry, sir. You have yourself a fine day, and I apologize for any offense I may have inadvertently caused. What are you drinking, mister? Nothing, sir. Nothing at all. Why are you acting so strange? I don't mean to. I'm sorry for any offense. How could you have offended me? I have no idea. But I had no idea how I offended the last fellas, and they stole my wagon on account of my impudence. Stole your wagon for back check? They didn't like my medical practice, I suppose. I was helping folk. Man wasn't popular? I was undercutting the competition. Or I was too colored. Or I was irritating in nature. Or I was some know-it-all big city slicker here to demean some good old boys of my fine words. The exact variety of my sins was a source of some conjecture, so they undercut me. That ain't very nice. That was my impression. Still, compared to the gutting, castration, defenestration, and crucifixion they offered me, I felt I got off lightly. Imaginative bunch. Yeah. But no great love for my medical practice. Too free with my wisdom and services. Which way they go? Down the road, that away. Stay here. I'm sort of forced to. <laughs> Please don't go to any trouble on my account. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm going to get him. Are you looking for that fellow's wagon? I heard him say they was taking it to Macomb's Inn. Okay, thanks. Which way is Macomb's Inn? It's quite a distance. I was going to say, can I run that? I could. But it looks like Roger's did. Excuse me, fine, you know what? Very, oh, we're going a very direct, direct route this episode. Fuck it. Into the mists, into the fog of war we go. Yeah. Where the road stops. Nobody goddamn well knows. But where is it? Hold on, let's just see who's trying to take me. Now, fuck this, we can cut straight through and then we'll, we'll meet up with the road. At the, at the intersection. Yeah, yeah. That's the strat. That's the save the time strategy right there. Oh, fuck. There we go, so now we're on the road again. Need is a fan, but unfortunately, I am not a fan. Roger, she needs a little bit of health too. Her health core is depleted somewhat. Tiny smidgen, but hey, Rose can't die. Me and her have been doing too much together. She's pretty much pro. She could, you know, get a little bit more stamina, but apart from that, she's pretty much pro. Oh, you know, I don't even know what Rose's stats are like, to be honest. Bayou. Must be getting close right now in the bayou. Here we go. There we go. Stay here, Roche. Um. Doctor friend of mine lost his wagon. You all ain't seen it, have you? Up with it. Ain't it? You tell your friend. I'm sick of Oh, fuck. Oh 
shoot me now. Oh. I see you there. No, I'm not. Five cents, boo. I missed the good old days. I was getting twenty or thirty dollars. Yeah, they could have gone better, but hey. Dynamite, Jesus. The dynamite kid over here. He just took out the dynamite kid. Swamp critter food now. Oh, my boots. Ah, oh, fuck. Can I get into this house or the uh, locked house? The locked house. That's fine. Ooh, the horses are in the muck too. Ugh. Doctor re renews. Gross. Swamp horses. I like it's like oh, it's like a mixer stone thingy on top. I was like, what is this? Makes it hard to see. Why don't you come with me? Come on, buddy. I'm not leaving you in here with the, the swamp people. So interesting. Yeah, interesting wagon. I like it apart from maybe the giant grinding stone thing on top. Kind of looks like a top hat with a cigar. That's just me. One shot. Wow, that must have been a good shot. He found he's like Luke in the um, Death Star. Right, let's get the rifle ready. Do you know, tell you what, when we see those fellows, oh, I've got full health. Look at that. It's not me. Come on, Roach. It's definitely not me. I took the, the, the miracle cure thingy. So this wagon must be as rickety as it fucking looks. She's just tapped down some garage, isn't it? Thank god, that's hard to aim. Yeah. Alright. Wait there. Suck, we know that. There's only two of them, that's on. Come on, Roach. We should just. Yep. Yep. Now, Roach, you're kind of in the way there, but. What's his turn? Idiot. 
Alright, we made that difficult. Or just still follow me, right? Had a girl. Yeah, right, we're back on the roads. Now I'm scared of all the riders on the paths. Oh fuck. Miss my return. Miss my return. Apologies. It's so big, like I can't shoot from it because like, the angle's so weird. He looks friendly. He's going the same way as me. It couldn't be a problem, right? Stuck. He's turning good. It's a long sucker. Just cautious of yeah, any other people right now. Are we get held up or shot at or move along, sir. Fine gentlemen go by. That's right, no trouble to me. Atta boy. Keep walking. Didn't see you. You didn't see shit. That's how we do it. Uh oh. No, he's fine, he's on a big wagon. Just like myself. I should be fine now because I'm back in the roads, right? Theoretically. A renewed proprietor. Count on seeing that wagon again. No, you for that matter. Only people you won't be seeing are the folks that took it. Uh, I take it they aren't the only ignorant bullying clodhoppers in these parts. But I can live in glorious hope. Ah, it wasn't a trouble now, was it? No, it was a pleasure. Well, let me give you something for your pleasure. Ah, what we got here. Ah, how about this? Provide a man a tincture? He'll be well for a day. Teaching to make one, he might be well a while longer. I'll make sure to try and make this. Thank you. <sighs> Thank you. It won't work for anything chronic, but you may not need it to. Well, if you see me on my travels and you're in need of something, make sure you come and say hello. Travel safe now. What I get? Inspect document. Ah, oh, health cure. Ginseng, yarrow, English, mace, or milkweed. Oh. Well, how about that? Where'd Roach go? Roach. I see you on the map, Roach. Don't see you in real life, though. Oh, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is he following me? This is a different. No, this is a different guy. The other guy had an arm. Hey, Mister, will you give me some money? If you have a dollar. It's carrying the smell of shit away. Well, thank you. Say, say, where you from? Around. <laughs> Ain't from right here. That was you, I'd leave. This town lost its goddamn sign a long time ago. <laughs> Nothing but nasty, miserable people. Yeah? Yeah, ever since them, them greys moved here. 
You bunch of no good whack trash. Yeah, they, they somehow got rich. About 50 years ago, they moved here, caused a whole heap of trouble. Yeah, they reckon they was, reckon they was Yankee spies during the war and everything. That's so. Yeah, sure. Thanks for the tip. Show me something. So, hi, Roach. Roach wants that apple, sir. Or that knife. I don't think Roach have a knife. I'm just saying. All right. Um. Here we are. Oh, there's another Stranger Danger. Stranger Danger Rose is a. I want to see if there's a stable, but there isn't a stable. There's a saloon though, and then there is. Whoa, we're actually really near the um, with John. So, Bill and Josh Artelani. Interesting, interesting, ladies and gentlemen. What will, what will we do next time? I guess you'll find out next time. Yeah, that's how the next time works.